Are you ready? Kim Woodburn is here with more advice on how clean is your house. So the most important aspect of all things is your washing because this will reduce dust and bacteria in your household. So what we do is open the door with the washing in and you can either put them on the line outside or personally if it's pissing down with rain just put them on the radiator. So the, for the most important thing is just any dust that's just above near your ceiling. So the first thing we need to do, I'm going to climb on here and eliminate as much dust as I can with this micro duster. This eliminates any cobwebs that may feature on your cupboards. Because nothing stains clean forever, which is why you must keep on top of it at all times. And on top of the heater very gently. I've already done the lights so we don't need to worry too much about that. And then to focus on here. So what we need to do next is make sure that you tops of your net curtains here and on top of the windows too. You can't completely get rid of dust but by doing this house cleaning on a regular basis will take it right down and it's very good for your health that you keep doing this as well. And I've just realised I forgot to extend this, but never mind. So we just go like this in the corners. Top of the microwave as well. Okay, so for this next bit here, we're going to put the handheld steamer on. So at the bottom, just turn it on. Okay, so very carefully use flash bleach and then what we do is put things out of the way a little bit, like this. And it's important that we get every single bit of surface. So if we go, it would help if I turn the bastard thing, but never mind. Well, make sure you spray the cupboards if you've got cupboards like this. And also with the cooker. It's a very strong smell, but it can be good for your household if you do this on a regular basis. Right, so let's get started.
Okay, that's one example. I should be back soon. Till the next time, goodbye.